on everyone, this is Jaren from Sport and Spine. Um, just a quick video to show you how to use the spiky ball uh, to release the muscles in your back. Um, this is really useful for those who have low back pain, uh, mid back pain, hip pain, uh, even pain down and through your, your legs and your glutes. Uh, in certain instances this is really useful for that. So I'm going to show you how that works. So we're going to lie on your back. <coughs> And uh, the first thing is to try and make sure that you place the ball properly. So we want to try and place the ball. If I lie on my side, here's the bony spine here. We want to place the ball just next to the bony spine. So not all the way out here. We want to place it just off the side of the bone. So when I place it just off the side of the bone, I'm going to put all of my weight on that area. And what we're going to do is we're just going to roll in and around that area until we find a sensitive spot. Try and keep in that channel right next to the bone. Once I've got a sensitive spot, I'm going to grip in behind my thighs here, and then I'm just going to do a slight crunch. So when we do that crunch, that movement, we're trying to open up the joints and try and break down the stickiness that exists in and around the tissue. So every time you feel a spot, one, two, we're just going to do two, and then we're just going to roll onto the next spot. So I'm just going to create some more space here. And every time we roll all the way up the spine and find a spot, we're just going to do a crunch. One, two. Now what you can do is as you get into the thoracic area, so where your ribs are, from your ribs up, we're just going to try and give yourself a big hug. So once you've got a spot there, let's just bring it up a little bit higher, so we're just going to roll. Once I've got a spot there, just give yourself a hug, and then we're just going to crunch up in that position. Now, from mid-chest all the way up to your neck, by the time you get up into these top areas, when we roll, by the time you get into these top areas, it's going to be more of a head movement. But I still want you to give yourself a big hug to open up the joints. So we're hugging. One, two, and you can do that all the way up to your shoulder height, and then cross over to the other side and go back down. There's also another channel that sits just on the outside of that, where once you get the spot, you can just run parallel up and down there as well. Ciao,